Hey, what's going on guys? Welcome back. So, I'm very excited today. I have my Armour Crayon back out. The Armour Typhon Mega Hybrid. I have the upgraded differentials in here now, the steel differentials. So the car started off with Mod 1, I think, differentials, plastic or composite. And then I had to change to the Mod 1.5, I think they are, they are the uh, 3S versions of the differentials for this um, specific chassis design. They kept blowing as well, so I had to get the steel differentials for it. I put 80,000 weight in both the differentials, but I topped the front one up with a little bit of 100 weight shock oil just to thin it out a little bit and I and I topped the rear one up with I think it was uh, 55 weight oil so yeah that should be should be pretty good I'm still running the HBX hammerhead rear shocks I've just got HSP 1 8 uh, front shocks on it at the moment they're gonna have to do I haven't got anything else that kind of fits this car but um yeah we'll see how we go I'm just glad it's going again and there's no clicks. Actually sounds completely different with the steel differentials. Dad and Lee are both up here waiting for me. I told them to, to head on up because I wanted to do a little bit of the review. It's a little bit hard doing reviews with um, other people here. Sounds much better with the steel differentials. I think those differentials got to loosen up a little bit. Because I use such thick oil. Alright, ready, set, go. Oh no! Don't break, don't break. Oh yeah, the oil in the uh, differential is a little bit thick. No, no. Such a smooth car. It's got so much more acceleration than I than I remembered. Oh, I lost throttle in in the air then for some reason. Oh, is that my battery already? Nice, very nice. <laughs> oh, beautiful. <laughs> nice alright guys so I got the other battery in we just had a bunch of dogs check out the cars so um yeah had to had to switch off for a little bit oh no crashed oh no upside down
Oh, straight in the bush again. Seem to do that a lot on this jump now. Don't aim it up properly, obviously. It's not getting much. Seems a lot slower than it used to be. Here we go. That was a better one. Oh, wow. Oh, <laughs> they sound pretty bad when they land, don't they? Well, the differentials are definitely working good. Just doesn't seem. Yeah, it's a bit. It's a bit odd. Maybe it's because I've been driving the bigger cars so much lately. I'm not quite used to this car anymore. Don't know. Right guys, I'm gonna have to try and tighten this wheel up and if it doesn't doesn't work, then I think these wheels are done for. I think we're gonna have to run different wheels from now on. Which really sucks, because I love these wheels. And it might last a little while. The hex inside the wheels completely rounded off now, so yeah, they're no good. close oh I don't want it to run in front of it. <laughs> that would would not do a backflip then. wheel again. Gonna have to get some new wheels. My battery, that's all gone. Mm, mm. <laughs> Alright guys, well it looks like I'm out of battery. Lee's out of battery. Dad's obviously still going. I don't know how those 3,300 milliamp Yumi powers last so long in his car. Oh, that was beautiful. <laughs> I'm definitely happy with the differentials. Um, I definitely need a new wheel. So, yeah, the hex inside the wheel is completely destroyed. So, definitely up for a new set of these wheels because I, I like them. I think I do want another set. Um, but everything else seems good still, I think. HSP front shocks are holding up somehow. And uh, HBX rear shocks definitely they always go really well. So oversized for this car. They're actually off a one-sixth car. So yeah, I don't think that ever break on this 
So I'm gonna leave it here because yeah, dad will probably want, oh, dad's got a tree growing out of his car. <laughs> <laughs> How'd you manage that? How did you do that? Oh, God. Oh. <laughs> Catch us in the next video and stay safe. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed the video, don't forget, leave a like, subscribe if you want to see more, and feel free to leave any comments or questions down below.